cool. Cool, cool, cool. That's better. Howdy. Drink the water. I drink the water every day. <laughs> nah, I was first. Hi, Eleanor. What a cutie. Eleanor is here. I gotta remember to get her to the vet soon, because she's gross. Um... <laughs> So my desk is like really big. I can't touch the floor. But the other problem is that if I were to put my cam on top of my monitor, you wouldn't see me. But then if I turned it and like bent it forward, you would also see the letter box behind me. So I kind of propped it up on one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten different games. It's stacked on top of ten games. So like PlayStation boxes. Oh, so I had a hard time. I couldn't find Mario Odyssey. Well, I found it in the box, the backpack where I keep my uh, where I keep my Xbox, but it was empty. And I was like, what? And then I found it in Let's Go Pikachu. And I'm like, what? And Let's Go Pikachu was just bouncing around loose. But our Mario Odyssey was actually like in the spot, so that's the funny, funny part. Um, is everyone sleepy in the Discord? They better show up. I know that Jill's probably getting out of work, so she should be here soon. But um, it's time to boogie. Last time, oh. I need to get the ambiance. So I'm trying to do a spooky game every week. So this week, I'm just gonna keep uh, keep up with uh, Frampo. But to get the ambiance, I need to turn my light off. Oh, I'm stuck. <laughs> ambiance. All right, spooky time. I feel like I look like- this looks like a professional stream, doesn't it? I like green. It's one of my favorite colors. My other favorite color is purple. So... I need to make like a little thing that like shows that I'm having a spooky night besides my background. Like hashtag spooky night or something. Hi Lexi! You missed the first- uh, you missed this on Halloween, but uh... Part of the game, we were in a uh, a mental hospital, and now we're free. <gasps> All right, so we're free from the mental hospital. Um, lots of very sad, abused children there. Now it's time for um, whatever we we were finding our cat. Was that correct? All right. What was the voice I was doing for her? I th it was something really stupid. I was like... I don't know. What is this place? I hope I find Mr. Midnight soon! No, that's my little... That's my little, uh... British orphan voice. Look at Trumpet. Ha ha ha, I remember something funny! What's funny? It says Jants, and I have no idea why. You mean Jean Pants? <laughs> Dear, your arm is gone. Good that you're not bleeding. Bears don't bleed. Or te teddy bears don't bleed. Hello, tree. I talk to trees, too. Take our pills and see what's happening. 
Oh, a key. Curiosity is damned. Damn you, curiosity. What was that? Oh, I like to be curious. Otherwise, how would you learn things? What are you? Are you... You are kind of curious yourself. What is the right question? But why should be more appropriate? I want the key. I don't have time to chat, sir. I want the key. That is all. Did she just assume the gender of this tree? Hi, Jill. You picked a good time to lurk. You could be like Uhi Uhime and play me in the car. She does that. It's kind of cute. But that key isn't ours, and it's not yours for sure. Just give it to me. I want to know what door can be opened with this. We couldn't care less. The affection towards you is simply none. I'm a person. Then what's the point? Interesting. Tell us more. I'm lost, I think. I'm trying to find my cat. Really? Yes, really. Now please, give me the key. Look, person Fran, we came from the south, flying as always. And one of us got curious about this key. And all of us got stuck here. Hi, Nana, how you doing? And because of our long hair, we can't get loose. Can I help? We usually get stuck on trees, but we have something to fix that. A beautiful comb to comb our hair every time we get stuck. Give it to me. I can fix you. This is a problem. A filthy thief took the comb. Now we are stuck forever. If you find the thief and the comb, you will have the key. Deal? Well, what does he look like? It's a rat. A filthy, narcissistic rat. No politics, but... There's someone I'm thinking of as a filthy narcissistic rat. Yeah. <laughs> it's the perfect time of year that I want to take pictures of you in the forest, so. What does he... Oh, uh, he took the comb to be beautiful. We couldn't do much, so he ran away with it. Please find it and free us from curiosity. I'll try my best. We will be here, waiting. Cool. Oh. That was, a uh, spooky. There's a shoe over here. Oh, yeah. Remember the king? He was the, the little boy who was, uh... Like, hallucinating that he was, uh... A king or something. I don't remember. What are these guys in the back? What does this say? Make an entry. Oh! I don't know, I'm not brilliant. Whoa, the terrible axe. I will be a warrior. That went by too quickly. Can I knock a tree down? Owl. <laughs> I want to use an axe on an owl. That's not how Animal Crossing works. I just said you're a bird. Hmm. Can I use the axe on this tree? I could use the axe on the barrel. All right, let's untake our pills. I don't know. I'm. Uh. 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 This is gross. 
gross. It's a pig. You're a very big ant. Who's there? Are you real? Oh, you always ask the same thing. Always? What do you mean by always? Of course I'm real. Where did you come from? Oh, I escaped the mental hospital, but please don't tell anybody. I won't tell. Don't worry. But what are you doing here? Bad things happened to me, sir. But now I'm looking for my cat. A cat, you say? A black cat with very big yellow eyes. Mr. Midnight. Oh, I see. I'm sorry, girl. So you haven't seen it? It happens that it happens to be that cat is eaten, chewed and swallowed. Ian, what do you mean? The black cat came towards me in a hurry. I catch it. I give it to my beetle pig. My beetle pig is hungry. Oh, my poor beetle pig hasn't had any food in days. The blueberry time passed by and we ate them all. Stop it! Can't you see? Mr. Midnight's the only one I have! Everything is wrong! Wrong! Oh, little girl, don't cry. I can sing for you if you like. Yeah, right? This is so creepy. No, you're a murderer. You don't know how it feels to be alone. I do know, yes. I'm the last one alive. Let me help you, yes. Okay, we're gonna refrain from this sentiment here. <laughs> How could you possibly help me? The digestion is not so fast, you know. Maybe he's still alive inside the beetle pig. Should I do something like make the beetle pig vomit? Oh, I love Kablam. I miss Kablam. Kill the beetle pig. He is only the only friend I have left. I need the meat. I can do it. Kill your beetle pig friend? I can do it, yes. Do it. You can do it. <laughs> Execute Order 66. You can kill the beetle pig. And I, Antonio the Greatest, shall eat the meat. Uh, okay. Well, I guess I'm gonna use the axe on the beetle pig. Oh. Uh, <laughs> okay. This is really weird. Come on. I gotta kill you. Antonio needs to eat you. So much pink in the chat. I can never tell who's who. Oh my god. Okay. Well. I feel like... I can't see the beetle pig if I'm taking my pills. Okay, that doesn't work. Mm. Hi, belated karma. I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing. Okay, so if he won't stay still, I need to find something to bait him. It said that he liked blueberries, but the blueberry season has passed. There's got to be something in this pile over here that I could use. 
Oh, really? Okay. I mean, there was the key. The ghosty guys. Very rare leaves. Uh, I overlooked. I mean, it was this. Oh. Okay. I mean, I thought that was like the way to the next area. <gasps> Ooh, I'll tickle him. Okay. I'll tickle the pig. Okay, maybe I won't tickle the pig. Hi, Mugen Shiki. Thanks for coming by, man. What? I I know. Thanks for following, Yvonne McFly. Hope you have a good night. I did try to tickle the pig. It won't do. Oh, I need to tickle the man, the the weird ant man. Tickle, tickle, tickle. Ah, the threat is great, great. Sir, wake up now. I think the beetle pig does not like the idea of being killed. Oh, I see. But that is completely normal, isn't it? What should I do, then? You have to give him the special berries. The berries, hmm? I see. But where do I find these berries, then? I shouldn't say this to you, but I have the right connections. Sounds like we're making a drug deal. They live inside my house. They have blueberries. My house is in that direction. Be careful. Oh, thank you, sir. Yeah, let's decriminalize berries. Congrats, uh, New Jersey, on your latest decision, by the way. Uh, my friend said my my friend had a had a message that actually made me chuckle. He said, um. The only state in the entire country... Oh, wait a minute. He said, It's good for the people in New Jersey because now they can legally get so high they don't have to think about the fact that they live in New Jersey. <laughs> I wouldn't want to live in New Jersey, that's for sure. If any of you live in New Jersey, I apologize, but... Don't be proud you're from New Jersey. <laughs> Alright, so... Here we are. Gonna cross. We'll cross that stream when we get to it. This kind of reminds me of Over the Garden Wall. This must be the Ant's house. It seems to be open, but very stuck. Well, like we do with everything. <laughs> yeah. Isn't this how you play Dark Souls? You smash everything? The art style is kind of over the garden wall. Not the content. I watched it last year for the first time. Like, I saw the first episode when it came out, but I never actually watched the show. <gasps> we need to, like, watch it together. We can have, like, a- we can have, like, a movie night on the- on the- on the, uh, Discord channel. Even though it's not a movie. Yeah, I need to figure out how to do that. I got I got like a list of things I need to figure out, including like I don't know how to do um what are they called? The commands. I need to figure out how to do commands so that you can do like exclamation point socials or something or whatever. I don't know, I gotta do that. And then I gotta figure out how to do sound commands, because that's a thing people have been doing. There's a lot of things I need to figure out to make my stream a little bit more fancier. But you know. Gotta do some research. 
but I can figure out how to sh how to do that. Okay, we got some glue. What's this? Oh, he's got some naughties. Oh, I should put that away. There might be miners watching. If you're a miner, out yourself, please, right now. <laughs> Uh, oh, his underpants. He also uh, glued that to the door. Tea time, sir. Okay. I... Hi, Soy Jen. Thanks for coming on by. You, uh, you missed the ant porn. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's see. I think the ant house is where the blueberries are. Ooh. You know, this kind of reminds me. <clears throat> I don't know how many of you have watched Hilda. This kind of reminds me of Hilda. Alright, enjoy your lunch. You know how, like, in Hilda, there's, like, the little guys everywhere, the invisible little guys? These are, like, the Hilda, the Hilda guys. The blueberries are oh, that hurt. Oh wait, that's the sound he made. I don't know how to pronounce that. Plus, we watched that last summer. <laughs> the Nysa? You're Nysa. Hey, don't gender strangers. How do you know that's a lady? <gasps> I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing, but even if I wanted to take the meat, I can't reach it. What a cozy little lamp. I thought ants never cooked their meals. I want to sleep with my kitty on a bed. Alright, so there's got to be something I can use against these guys. What if I use glue? What if we use the glue on you? Okay. I don't know what to use besides an axe. <laughs> There's water in the sink, so maybe I'll get something that has water. Oh, you know, now that I think about it, I haven't used my pills here yet. Oh, I don't like this. This is gross. Please don't eat me. Uh, yeah. Oh, the amp porn. I have to use the amp porn? I'm untaking my pills. What if I use the green crayon on the amp porn? No? Okay. I have remembered the ant porn. I'm not entirely sure. I don't need to use it. Okay. So she's sitting on some meat. She's all splayed out. She's, uh, yeah. Uh, I'm looking at her. Yeah, so I need this meat. But I can't reach it. So I could climb on the bench. Okay. Then grab the meat. Okay. Now I take my pills. 
that I hate. I don't like ants. Alright. Well, I got a bag. What's this? Oh, it looks like a churro. Okay. This poor man. You have tons of ants on you. Okay. Now, what's in... Swiggity swag, what's in the bag? An anti-bug sign. The bag is open. Okay. Let's... I didn't want to do that. I want to stay away from that as much as possible. Oh, it's a rat trap and a card. We got exterminator. Text is almost gone. Poor tiny monsters. And we got the trap. Let's use the trap on this. Okay. What if we use the crayon on that? Am I clever enough, though? I could use... The glue... Oh! The trap, okay. Was there a rat anywhere near here? I'm trying to get the berries. I can use on... Use on you? Yeah! And then... <gasps> Wait a minute, what? Okay. It doesn't quite work. What if I use the glue on What did I do to get one of them to attack me? Maybe I'm not smart. Uh, this is Frambo. Um, I think Nana gave it to me. Either Nana or Jill. It's very weird and very trippy. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, honest to God. There we go. All right. Cool. Now I'll knock you over. Okay. There we go. Got the berries. Alright, let's get the heck out of here. Oh, he he hello! What's this? Is that a mushroom? Uh, what's it look like out here when you're on our pills? Just the shrooms. Oh, okay. Well, we got our berries. We can feed our berries to the really gross pig thing. And kill it! I don't like this! Oh, I gotta- Oh! <laughs> There's the rat. You are not my cat! Oh, miss, you saved me from misery! I gotta do a, a, a rat voice. Where is Mr. Midnight? I assume the 
that you're feeling disappointed in who are you looking for? My lovely cat, Mr. Midnight. Just use my normal voice? Yeah, last time I tried to make voices, uh, I strained my throat a little too much. Oh, Miss Lady, I'm not very fond of cats, you know. A black one with very yellow, big yellow eyes was trying to catch me. Really? My cat is also black. Wait a minute, maybe that cat is my cat. Oh, my lady, if he is, then he's the one in trouble now. Tell me where you saw him the last time, please. I can show you. Follow me, please. It's not far from here. Okay. Well, he's the one who stole the comb. So, we're trying to get the comb from the rat. I pity everyone who is not here right away, so they have no clue what's happening. They just disappeared. Could you be more specific? I wish I could. It looked like the earth swallowed them. If there is anything else I can do for you, just let them know I'll be around. The earth swallowed them. Oh, it's a dead rat. I never know what's going on. Have you met me? Okay. Maybe I'm gonna go talk to the man. The ant man. The beetle pig is dead now, sir. Thank you. Now we eat. I can't, just so you know. Inside the beetle pig, there was no cat, but a rat. A rat? Oh, I'm sorry. You see, my eyes are very old. I also have heart problems and a very bad back. I also suffer from narcolepsy sometimes, so I don't... <sighs> mm. Maybe I could get an exterminator on him. Can I take my axe back, please? Hmm. Did you steal the hair comb? Oh, the hair comb. The shiny, beautiful hair comb. Can I have it, please? All right, then. But you can please comb my hair first. Sure. I'll comb your hair. Aw, that's so cute. I like rats. Shout out to J. Edgar Hoovy. You like rats. Thank you, my lady. You are very kind. Yeah, 10 out of 10. Good rat. All right, now we can... Comb the spooky tree. Yeah. Why can't I? Why can't I? Uh. Here's your beautiful comb, misters. Stop assuming the gender. All right. Oh, you found the person. You finally did it. Hope the key opens the door you wish to open. Now we fly south as at last. Goodbye. Well, that was different. Oh, beautiful. Goodbye, shiny misters. Have a nice trip. Cool, I got a key. Oh. All right, neat. Uh... Can I use the key at all on this? That's very peculiar. I wonder who the spooky man is in the background. So if the earth swallowed them up. Ah, my cat. Vroom, bip, bip. Look, friend, I'm in danger. Okay, um. Okay. In a golden cage. Okay. I don't really 
have anything. Uh, yeah. Was there a ca golden cage at all? Oh wait, what's this? A door handle. It's a big problem, so I'll keep it. All right, maybe if I do this, then I put the door on this, or can I combine this with this? Okay. Hmm, it's not where the door handle goes. But, said it was swallowed by the ground. So I need to... Maybe... This is ground, right? Oh, I'm cold? So I need to go back to the well. Yeah. What are those sounds? Make an entry. I have to make an entry. Okay, that's what I was doing. But why won't it? Oh, 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 oh. I need to combine with the glue. Yeah. Excuse me? Can I... Combine... That? No. Can I... Oh, this is painful. <laughs> Why doesn't it work? I glued it. Do I need to be like here and then I'm confused. I'm very confused. <laughs> this game is nuts. Yeah, right? I'm missing an item. What am I missing? Do I need like one of these planks? Or... Okay. I got everything you can see while you're on pills. Hmm. So. I'm cold? It's not over here? Alright. Is it on the page? this page. Maybe. Uh, I've never... I don't know what Nightmare Net is. Mm -hmm. Okay. Might be in that giant jumble. Because I don't see anything else here. Ooh! Yeah! We got it, we got it, we got it. Alright. How come my girlfriend knows who Nightmare Net is and I don't? 
Well, I'll have to do some research, see what that's about. I like old PC games. What a curious little door. This is like Alice in Wonderland. Wonder where it will lead me. Mr. Midnight, are you here? Yeah, I don't got no swag. Oh, I don't like that. Double personality. Alright. Oh my goodness, where am I? What, what is this, a hat? It's a cat hat. Mr. Midnight, oh no, your head! Kitty! Wait just a second, this is not my kitty. What a weird hat. Okay, there's a bunch of meat here. There's a letter. Let's read the letter. Welcome home, beautiful kitten. We hope you like your new bed. Be nice and eat your food. Love, Clara and Mia. Are they roommates? Okay. There's meat here. They were roommates. Oh, they're sisters. Sisters! Firewood to keep the chimney warm. There is a boven. A cooker to cook. I want the honey. Can I have the honey? Baking soda. Cookies? Can I have the knife? A knife! <laughs> and a spoon. Who wants the spoon? <laughs> Okay, so I guess these are the sisters. Oh, the window's open. Ew, they got eyes in a jar. Okay, let's look out the window. Oh! But I can close the window. Okay, this floor is a different color, so there's something up here. No, that's gotta be a trapdoor. All my Dark Souls days have told me this is a trapdoor. Yeah, you keep eyes in your skull. Duh. Let's get... <laughs> this smells like weed! Soul... Beans? I like beans! Weed. A funny smelling bag. Hmm. What is that? Okay, a hairy little seed. Yeah, you do. It's kind of creepy. Oats, beans, rice. Pepper. Garlic, pepper, olives. Ooh, he may is that you who's the one who eats uh tons of uh olives out of the fridge. Yeah, she's pretty cool. Kinda weird. <laughs> but aren't all girlfriends weird? Whoa, I have matches. I'm gonna examine some of this stuff. There's gotta be... I know there's a door over there, but we're gonna take our pills and see what's up. Oh, I don't like this! Secret bottle! Uh... I'm 
I'm not the biggest fan of olives. You guys have... You guys can murder me if you'd like. A bridge. Okay, I don't have anything I can make a bridge with. We may have to click every single one of these to get down. Ooh, what's in here? Okay. On pill. Oh, okay. It's just the same room. I could what? I could jump? I could throw my knife. Guess I can't throw my knife. Um on oh. I untook my pills and it took me back here. What if I put my seed in the water? No. Well, let's just keep looking around. Teapot with no tea. Uh, some cakes. Yeah, girl, get some chocolate cake. I'm gonna take this knife and I'm gonna use it on this chocolate cake. If I was in a random pe person's house and there was chocolate cake, I might take the chocolate cake. Let's look at the picture of these ugly girls. Okay, they're not ugly. They're just creepy. They look familiar, but I'm not sure. Could it be? <gasps> titty! You gotta censor the titty. Tiny house in the middle of nowhere. There's a creepy deer head. Firewood. There's something about fire that I had. Ooh, I got a face. Okay. Oh, hello. Hello. Who are you? Can't you hear me? I'm Fran. Uh, this is her sliced up body. Okay, I don't like that. Jance. Jazz ants. The Blueberry Tree Volume 2. Oh, he's famous. He's a famous trumpeter. So that must have been his trumpet in the pile. Can I listen to the jants? Jants time, jants time. We're listening to jants. Jants time, jants time, listening to jants. Very fancy. Everyone drink your water. Alright. Typewriter. But there's no paper. A good writer has to know what to write about first. That's why I'm not a good writer, because I don't know what to write about. Well, there's another owl here. Ooh, just had a shiver. Okay. There's a picture of a cat. Yeah. Now this is pod racing. Oh, I'm back here again. Yeah, can I get a sip of water in the chat? Okay, we're up here. We got a boom. A little boom. We got a Satan and a goat. We got the girls again. 
I got some candles. Let's combine the candles with the... No. Okay. What's this? I don't know. Maybe because I'm good at recognizing faces. Okay, I'm not ready for that yet. I'm I'm not logical, but I'm romantical. So I guess the girls got murdered in this house. This is like look this is like what Uhime's room looks like. <laughs> Except much less Sora. Qu'est-ce que say? Tweezers. Okay. Can I look at myself in the mirror? Oh, I cannot. Hi, Soy Jen. Oh, I just fell. Okay, I don't like that. Brought me back down. Okay, let's keep going. Let's see what's up here. It is very dark. Maybe now we can use matches on this. Okay, guess not. Oh, there's the golden cage. I am very confused at all times, trust me. There we go. Very confused. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I don't like that at all. I do not like that at all. Oh, I really don't like that. Oh, oh no, they keep crying. <laughs> oh, I do not like creepy children. Okay. The sisters are dead now. Okay, a hat. A doll. Yeah, ba baby 2x in the chat. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that was ter terrible. Ooh. Okay, there's a rabbit. Wait a minute. Is this the rat I saw from earlier? Mr. Rat, it's time to get up. I met another rat a while ago. Maybe the rat is dead. Okay, well, we have a key. Are you in here, kitty? Meow. I found you. Oh my goodness, my beloved friend, I found you. Friend, is that really you? Oh dear, finally. Yeah, I used to work with children. Now I realize I don't like children. I don't know. Something seems kind of... Okay. So it is our cat. I missed you very much. I had dreams about you. And here you are. Thank you for not giving up. I love you, my friend. I love you too, Mr. Midnight, and I really missed you. Dear friend, how did you find this place? Yeah, I worked with high schoolers, so, like, that was my mistake. Maybe the younger children might like me, or they just might not get me, but... I don't know. I'm happy with where I'm at. Kind of. <laughs> are we ever truly happy? Yeah, every time me and Uhime walk by a, like, a baby section at a store, and we see, like, the, the little baby chairs that you put, like, the car seats and stuff, we're like, oh, look, a gamer chair! <laughs> because most gamers are babies, let's be honest. Yeah, you do, actually. Congrats on your, uh, your promotion. You don't work directly with them, but... Yeah, and I think that's a really cool motivation. Oh, I'm getting sleepy. I started drinking coffee before my streams. I can't tonight because I got a 7 a.m. I got double tomorrow. I'm working 7 a.m. to 1.30, and then 9.30 to 1.30 a.m. So. Yeah, let's get a W in the chat for J. Edgar Hoovey. You get, you got it. You, you are 
I like that. You are helping those less fortunate than you. Alright. After those people took you away in the woods, I tried to follow them. But after a while, I got lost. My senses were too weak to track you. I tried to catch some food to recover, but something happened. Somebody took me and put me in this cage. I will open the cage. Yeah! The Weezer W. Is that what they do? Alright, we need to get to Aunt Grace. Fran, I'm very tired. I wish everything was a bad dream. I'm tired too. <laughs> it's gonna be fine. We just have to get out of here. Fran, can I ask you something? Sure. Mr. Mimnite, what is it? Did you feel my presence in your dreams? Yeah, I did. You told me to take the medicine and find you. What medicine, Fran? It wasn't really me talking to you. I think somebody was helping us get together. Every time I had dreams about you, I felt the presence of something else. A presence? What kind of presence? For what I felt, it wasn't human, but it was pe really peaceful and kind. That's the real magic. Great to have somebody else taking care of us. Fran, did you hear that? Did you... Oh, I'll see what it is. I'll try to find the key to unlock you. Alright? I love you. Well, I... Oh, I don't have a key anymore. Hmm. Okay. Very bloody fox taxidermy. Big shoes. Okay. An umbrella. Oh, I don't like that. I'm gonna go back up and then I'm gonna walk over here and then I'm gonna take my pills. And... No. Okay, I gotta click these individually, which is annoying. Maybe I can use the broom. Yeah. Well. I, uh, made a goof him up. These have to belong to something. Like maybe if I combine these or combine baking powder with the seed. Oh, it's called a moonlight seed. Oh! Yeah, that did scare me. Uh, my head is just in the right place. You, the precious being from the other world. Who would ever believe us? What are you saying? I can't make sense of what you're saying. Fran Bo, that's your name, right? And your mom and died, dad died tragically. Very brutal, right? And now you really want to know who killed them, right? How do you... Slow down. How is it that you know all this? We just know. We have to. You're part of this world. But don't be sad. Bad things happen to all of us all the time. I feel lost. I wish nothing bad happened to me. I feel completely lost. Don't wish for things that can't be done. Find solutions and answers. They won't come... I should do that, but Mommy and Daddy will never come back. Drink some tea. Eat some cake. It'll make you feel better. Thank you, but really, I need to know. Who told you these things about me? Are you scared, little friend? A little. It's odd the way I came here. This conversation makes me confused. You haven't asked about your cat yet, Mr. Midnight. It's very odd for a girl who loves her cat more than anything else in this world. I don't know. I think Uhime loves her cats more than uh, Fran does. I bet if uh, she got kidnapped or was, you know, in a ba very bad hospitalized location, she would probably be like, I want my cats. And yet, you look so calm after finding him in a cage, hungry and scared. Shouldn't it be us trembling in fear of you? I'm not calm. I, I just wanted to introduce myself. I'm not a rude person. You want him back? Unlock the cage. He is hungry and thirsty, please. Before we set him free, tell us about how it is that you came here. It's a long story. I escaped from a place. 
a very ugly place. They open the heads of children to find what's wrong with them. Yeah, throwback to when we saw that kid getting a lobotomy. That was not cute. Phil told me a secret, and I was clever enough to find the way out. Good old Phil. <laughs> then I came into the woods and met a giant ant. And I killed a bug, and it was terrible. And then I met a rat who wanted to get his hair done. <laughs> no cussing in the chat. Then I met a rat who wanted to get his hair done. And then I made a door. That door took me here. But when I entered the door, something happened. I don't remember anything else. Ah, and I saw a real, I saw a real pinecone family. That was before I came here. They live in Mr. Antonio's house. They like berries. His name is Antonio, because he's an ant. Ah, I saw flying insects that got stuck in trees because they have long hair. There was also in the woods. And now I'm here, looking for Mr. Minute. You know what this reminds me? There was this book series I used to read as a kid called Aberat. This kind of reminds me of Aberat. Just the whole, like, discombobulated girl in a very weird world. I need to read those books again. Looking for Mr. Midnight. That was some adventure. How old are you, Fran? I'm ten years old. I have to turn eleven soon. And you? We are sixteen years old. Much older than you. So you have to obey us. You can't tell me what to do. I don't want to obey, obey you. Alright, see you later, man. I'll chat you up. Thanks for coming on over. I love you. All my friends were here, and I think that's pretty neat. Watch your mouth. <laughs> Alright, um... You haven't even asked our names. That's not polite. And you shouldn't wander around in a house without permission. Are you stupid? A stupid little girl with no family at all. Stop that, please. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude. Are you crying? Because if you are, you'll get in trouble. And if you don't do exactly as we say, your cat will die. Do you understand? Yes, ladies, I'll do whatever you need. Good. Now listen to us carefully. We need you to perform a little magic trick on us. Do you like magic? Magic is magical. Who doesn't like magic? Anyway, this magic is very powerful. It's tremendous and dangerous. Here's the recipe. Be cautious and precise. Otherwise, terrible things can happen. Why can't you do it yourselves? We can't do it. It would kill us. You see, we weren't like this before. We used to be two different people in two different bodies. But how is it that you're like this now? One night, a long time ago, something appeared in front of us. We thought it was an angel, but it was not. He decided that we should spend eternity together. He cursed us to be like this. We never understood why, but we have a spell to bring him back. But we will do that later, when we're not attached to each other anymore. And show him that he is powerless and he will regret it. That sounds terrible. I'll try my best to help you. We are going to gather some things you'll need for the ritual. In the meantime, you can go and talk to your cat. But we won't set him free yet. Don't even try to open the cage. If you help us, we will help him. Thank you. Go and talk to him. And Fran, do you see this key? Can you imagine what can be opened with it? Can you, you silly girl? Ha <laughs> ha. Rude ass. Yeah, it's knife time. Give me the cake. Okay, I just need to grab it. I want a cake right now in my belly. My real belly. Alright, let's read the, re read the recipe. Lost in darkness, lost in tears, your body becomes a lie through the hand of the angel that decides to bring you sorrow. Heart of a frog, head of a young virgin. Well, I know a young virgin. <laughs> Ooh, you have to DM it to me. No spoilers for everybody. I don't think anyone's gonna... Uh, 
tier two me. All right. Oh, tier one subs. You uh, can use an emoji. It's this one. Yeah. That's Eleanor. You can see her little tongue. My little baby. <laughs> Heart of a frog, head of a young virgin. Hair and blood from a black cat. I have a black cat. Alright, I'm ready. I'm ready. Alright, that will keep uh, everyone... That will definitely keep everyone on their toes. So... <laughs> A uh, pentagram made of ashes, the burnt body of a fox. Salt must be cooked together inside a pot or a cauldron with plenty of water. When you're about to drink the potion, repeat these words. Can I show you guys something really cool? When you when you when I take my phone to the water bottle, it makes a little lantern. <laughs> I do this all the time when I uh need light and I'm going to the dumpsters I'm like ooh, spooky water pretty cool all right more sweets give me the candy give me the candy I want the candy all right let's see let's see let's see what this looks like Poggers in the chat! This is good! This is gonna be- oh, I forgot my camera's here. Look at that! Tier 1 sub! That's good. I like that. Oh, you get a 10 out of 10. I'm gonna buy you a dinner for that one. <laughs> we can get more Olive Garden. Can you believe Uhime had never, have our, uh, have never had Olive Garden before? Okay, so, uh, there's a headless virgin there. And those are the stairs to nowhere. Oh, look, my cat. Hello. Breadsticks. Yeah, they, they only gave us two breadsticks last time. I was very disappointed. Next time I'll be like, hi, I want extra breadsticks. Extra, extra breadsticks. There's a Jeff Rosenstock song that's like soup salad and breadstick days or something. Ooh. Can I talk to Kitty? Did you get the key already? Not yet. I'm sorry, those girls are scary. They just want to utilize me. They cut hair from me and took some blood. It's for the recipe. I think they're witches. Wicked witches. You know, like in stories we like to read? You're right. You're absolutely right. I don't know what to do. I don't know, Fran. What do those girls tell you? They told me they weren't attached to each other before. And that they will get revenge against the one who did this to them. And they also showed me a key. I'm pretty sure it's for this cage. They have evil inside. I mean, maybe that someone had its reason. I guess we have to fight evil with evil. There must be something that they're really afraid of. I don't know. I'll see what I can find. See you soon, my dearest. Well, this was, um, the babies. Is there something I could use on the babies? Like, maybe that knife? Um... Baby, do babies count as young virgins? Or do they have to be like... Like a... You know... A, a woman of age? Okay. Where's the... Oh! There's my cat. She's at my feet. Yeah, let's uh... <laughs> No, 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 I want to get away from them. I hate them. 
All right. Well. There is a cat at my feet. There is a cat. She's very neat. I wish she would not tickle my feet. That would uh, be nice. Okay. Can I look out the window? Alright. How about in here? Oh, hello! But I haven't taken my pills. We opened the window. Thank you, but who is he? Alright, cool. A frog. Hey, you! Yes, who's speaking? Me, I'm a toad. I have to tell you something. <laughs> yes, what is it? You're in great danger. Don't trust the girls. Why do you say that? Look, girl, I'm a toad. I know I can swim away from this place. But they won't let me every time I try to get out of here. I magically come back. This house is like a huge magnet. I'm stinky. I hate Bowman. <laughs> I magically come back. A toad and cat magnet. They love us. But not to give us the... Just to use us. Don't trust them. I won't trust them. I promise. They gave you a recipe for some kind of magic. Yes, they did. Did you see the dead girl in one of the rooms? Well, that can be you if you try to do it. She tried, but she did it wrong. But what should I do then? I'm not a clever toad, but if I were you, I'd be creative. Huh, creative. I'll try to do my best. And girl, please save us all. I really want to get out of here. Yeah, me too. Big rock. Okay, I got a board. I can use that. Rusty bicycle. Okay. Well. It is very annoying. I have to click these individually. Yay! <gasps> uh, what? I could... Yeah, I'm smart. Revealing the true soul. The world hides the truth from you. Work your soul through life and you'll understand the purpose of this act. If you try to corrupt this essence, your soul will be hidden and never see the face of truth. To destroy an impure soul or give freedom... Oh, pardon me. Ugh. To destroy an impure soul or give freedom to those who are trapped, you will need blood from the executor of the ritual, five black candles, ashes to form a pentagram, a blue bloomed moonlight rose, salt and pepper, hair from the person you want to bewitch. Draw a pentagram with the ash inside the black and white square. Black and white square? Hmm. Put a light black candle on every point of the pentagram. Fill a cauldron with water and put the other elements in it. Boil, pour over the person you want to bewitch. Repeat these words while you walk around the pentagram. Okay. So now I just need the hair. So what if we... Okay, I 
guess I'm not ready yet. Okay, I need to get hair, and I needed to get... Blood. No, I need... Yeah, hair and blood. And a bloomed midnight rose. Well, if I'm the one executing the ritual, I need to... That's not cute. Got blood. Alright. Picked a weird time. <laughs> Yeah, good luck with your with your classes. Hope everything goes great. Thank you. Okay. There's some water over here. Maybe I need to plant this. But where? Hmm. Not entirely sure. Okay. I'm close, you say. to make the flower. I need to get the flower. Doubters need the truth on paper. My sister's trying to catch me, but I ran away. Okay. This, uh, the moonlight flower. So it needs to be planted at night. I'm scared. Would you help me? I have a monster inside my head. Hi, Saint Warhead. Thanks for coming by. Okay, I'm really not sure. That's very weird. In the meantime, I can get the hair. I got the blood. I got the hair. I just need the. F I got the blood. I just need the hair and the seed. So maybe they have like a hairbrush somewhere? Like over here. It's going all right. Playing a very confusing game. This is a uh, First night in my new, or first uh, stream in my new apartment. It's kind of weird. I feel like I'm in a, I feel like I'm living in a hotel. I'm as good as I can be considering the circumstances of society. Um, where can I find hair? Can I exit this window? Hope you're doing well, Saint Warhead. You doing anything fun? Hmm. Well, they went up to the they might have gone up these stairs. Even though they end in a wall, which Nope, that still goes there. And I don't like that. 
Where can I get hair? Hmm. Very interesting. It needs to be planted in soil. Ah, there we go. It's a moonlight flower. I don't know, soil? Everything's planted in soil. I'm gonna collect soil in the jar, I guess. I don't know, you're just saying some pretty cryptic things. Oh, I got the ash. Okay. Is this the pot or the ash? A flower vase with ashes inside. I'm trying my best. I'm trying my best. Yeah, I planted it in the ground. But I don't know how to put it in the ground. Do I plant it in the frog? <laughs> or in the water? <gasps> oh! Okay. This is some bloodborne shit. Okay, now I got everything but the hair. If we look, I just need hair from the person I want to be witch. And I want to be witch the two girls. So now I need to figure out how to get their hair. I don't know. I'm kind of a realist, so. There's got to be hair from this thing. Got the jants. I just need to get some hair. Okay. There's like no bathroom where you'd find like a hairbrush. Alright, so, uh, where do I get hair? I think you would get hair from a pillow, honestly. Oh, there's a keyhole up there. Alright, how do I procure hair? I might need a hint. Oh, I have to have the spell they want ready? F 
Well, that means I need all of this stuff. And, uh, I don't really, uh, need that stuff. They, they told me that they were going to procure it. Now I just need to find them, I guess. Well, I guess I need to start the boil. Oh. Well, well, well. I wonder what that one thing was written on the wall outside. I don't remember. Okay. Let's see what that thing is that's outside. Daughters need the truth on paper. Okay. I do have the truth on paper. Alright, let's start with the ashes. Okay. And the candles. Okay. <laughs> yeah, right? Throw back to when uh, Uhime had bought the Satanic Bible. Fill a cauldron of water, put the other elements in it. Okay, so I need to put the blood in. Tra la la! Okay. <laughs> um, I need my candles, my ashes, my rose. Okay. Salt and pepper and the hair. Like I said, I just need the hair. Okay. Trickery. Hmm. 
Wrong? Okay. Warmer. So this one. With the dead girl. Okay. <laughs> oh boy. Um Oh. A typewriter and it works. Okay, but I need to use on the typewriter. There we go. A Hair from your head. There we go. Okay. All right, here we go. Here are the materials you need. Have you studied the ritual? Yes, but I'll need more time. I can't remember all the words. Well, learn them fast. Let us know when you're ready. Psst, girl, I think you need help getting rid of this bag. I can do that for you. But I may need it. No, you don't. Trust me. If we want to get out of here, this bag must disappear. I'll take it. You didn't see me. Bye. Okay. Now there's uh, blood everywhere. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. We're waiting for you, Fran. Uh, <laughs> Look, ladies, there's something missing. I couldn't find your hair in the bag. Hair, you say? There's no hair needed. We know that. Look yourself. It's written down there in the recipe. That's true. How can we miss that? All right. There. Now get prepared. I'll let you know when I'm ready. All right. All right. Well, thanks for coming by. Have fun at work. I guess if you think your job is fun. Good. Okay. Ooh. Yes. Have a good night. All right. <laughs> Yeah, maybe Jack can help me. I'll get good, trust me. Alright, let's go. Everything's ready, let's go to the kitchen. I hate these girls. They're so creepy. Okay. Please sit down and close your eyes, ladies. And... <laughs> and now say I'll say the words I'm not going to read that <laughs> uh. wait a second that is not the right spell you tricked us ooh Oh, <laughs> that's disgusting. Well, I guess their souls are free. Oh my goodness, this is not right. But I got the key. Okay. While I'm here, I'm very curious. Very, very curious. There's this over here. So what if this is this key is actually used here? Yes. A puzzle. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, right.
Oh, I see what I'm doing. Okay. This is like uh, when you're playing, uh, what's that game? Bioshock. Okay, why is that not rotating? I think I hacked up. Yay! Okay. Same? Oh, if I was uh, going through this experience, I would not be happy. They're small, like me. Sister Promise. We, Clara, and Mia Bulhamet, promise to revenge the unfair destiny it were decided as it were decided for us. With blood and tears, we promise that we will kill him and bring our bodies back. We won't stand for this any longer. Even though we are sisters, we hate each other and we will always hate each other. Nothing will ever change that. But now, with our bodies attached to each other, we can't complete our task. The strong strongest will live forever and the weakest will die. Mother must die. Ooh, Dulatine. So we're from the same place. So they're Gemini. Is their hair? So I guess. What if? So they're they're probably from the same hospital that Fran came from. Ooh, maybe the psychiatrist is an agent of the devil. That's very very interesting. Well, well, well. Well, well, well. I think this is the key. It worked, my dear kitty. It worked. Come out. Let me hug you. I got a kitty cat. Can I get a kitty cat emoji in the chat? Ah. That's so cute. Yeah, right? <laughs> yeah. Sorry, Jamie, you're not subbed. Then you can get the kitty cat emoji. But I love you anyway. Oh, this feels so good. I'm free, Fran, my good friend. Okay, we have to get out of here. Yes, let's go. <gasps> I got an achievement. I found Mr. Midnight. All right. Very creepy. Okay. Let's talk to the frog guy. Maybe he can help us. He's helped us before, and we really like the frog guy.
I did it, Sir Toad. The girls are gone. That is perfect. Now I can leave this place and go to my family. I want to do that too, sir. I finally found my kitty. I just want to go home and now be with Aunt Grace. But how will you get out of here? There's no boat. I thought you could help us get out of here. I would love to help you, but I'm too tiny. I'm not. I'm tiny, but I'm not too tiny. Even though my body is quite moldable, it would be impossible to carry you both to the other side. Let me think about it. Don't leave us yet, please. Okay, I got baking soda. Here, take this toad, it may help. I'm not a bakery bun. But you're slimy and soft like dough. You're right, it may work. Here it goes. That's a chonky frog! <laughs> I feel big and gorgeous. Maybe that's a secret to me being above five feet. I need to consume more baking powder. And less shortening. A. Hey. Alright, let's go. Come, Mr. Midnight. Sure, Fran. I only have one complaint. The giant toad is staring at me. What are you talking about? He wants to help us. That's all. Alright, if he tries anything, I'll scratch him. My cat's being loud, too. That's okay. Try not to hurt him so much while we're sitting on him. The water is deep, and we don't know what kind of creatures are in there. If we fall in the water, we could die, kitty. Oh, I promise I won't scratch the toad. Let's go. Hey, girl, before we go, I forgot to give you something. I saw you in this picture, so I thought it was yours. <gasps> that me. Wait, are the sisters her mom and her aunt? Maybe? No. They're from the same hospital. In this book, this is Leon. Hmm. Alright. Oh, Toad, you found my family photo. Thank you very much. I thought I had lost it forever, but the book is not mine. Oh, well, take the book as a gift. It's always healthy to read. It has many pictures. Wow, thank you. I like pictures. Well, let's go now. Yes, here we go. Hold on tight. Okay. Quaint, I guess. <gasps> I get to play Frogger! Can I play with my keyboard? No, I have to click. Oh no, I fell into water. Aw, thanks. This music is so bumping. I'm not the big chonk, I'm a little chonk. Oh, I'm so bad at this. I'm not good at video games, you guys. Oop. Guys, stop. Y'all are gay. <laughs> All right, here we go. Yay! Do not perceive me. I do not wish to be perceived. We did it! That was fun. Here we are. Jump off me now. Let's go, kitty. Yeah, this is Uhime as a child right here. Well, now it's time to go home. Hope you find your family soon, Sir Toad. Oh, I see you. Thank you, you two. Farewell. Goodbye, sir, and thank you for the ride. Fran, what should we do now? Find the way back home, kitty. Do you see the sky? It's dawn, and really soon, all the scary things will disappear. I'm so hungry and sleepy, I want to go home now. Me too, kitty. <laughs> yeah, I have no pronouns. Do not refer to me ever. Me too, kitty. We'll find a way. I'll do my best to help you, my dear. Let's go. 
All right. I do not like the sound of that. This bridge looks pretty scary. Come on, we'll have to go home. There's no time to be afraid now. But I'm afraid of heights. I can go first, right? Then you can follow me. All right, kitty, you're so sweet. I'll be right behind you. She's going to fall and be separated from her cat. Come on, Fran. Let's go. I'm waiting for you. Fran, wait. Uh, knew something was going to happen. That's not good. Oh my dear, I can't hold it anymore. I don't want to die. Oh good, she doesn't want to die. You don't die, my friend. Come on. You can do it. Jump. Alright, here I go. I got you. No! I'm not smiling anymore. That's for sure. Don't be afraid, Fran. We always fall. And after the pain, we will always rise. Oh dear, Aunt Grace, don't ever leave me. Don't cry, my little girl. Your heart is pure, but your mind is tormented. You have to stay and walk your own path. Please, Aunt Grace, why won't you just take me out of here? Please. You'll just leave me all alone like my mother and father did. I'm sorry, my dear Fran. You'll soon understand. Aunt Grace, no, please don't go. Please, please. Oh, this is so sad. Sigmund Freud's back. It's time for your new medicine. This is so sad. This game makes me sad. Okay. Oh, I'm the cat now! Her clothes are everywhere. What happened? Where am I, Fran? Where are you? <gasps> Whoa, wait. Is she the... Is she the tree? Was that the bite of 87? <laughs> She's a... Kitty, Kitty, stop it. What are you talking about? Fran, my darling, is that you? You can't be. What is it, my dear? Of course it's me. Who else would I be? Fran, you are a tree. Don't be silly. Help, get me up. Uh, wait a second. Where are my hands? Why can't I move? I'm telling you, my dear, you have become a tree. What? But how? Oh, my dear, this was the end of the line. The big monster did this. I know it did, Kitty. He won't let us go home. I hope he won't come back. That was He was very scary. He always comes back. I think I remember him from that night. The night Mom and Dad died. Kitty, I don't want to talk about it. I just want to go home. But you're a tree, my friend. A tree! I can't carry you all the way back home. Besides, I'm not sure where we are either. Am I going to die, Kitty? Tell me. Please don't say that, Fran. Please don't leave me. But I feel so weak. <laughs> what? Uh, what? Be careful, sir. Why are you attacking me? Could you please tell me where I am, sir? Stop it. I'll scratch you. What are they saying? Oh, my kitty. What is happening to us? Stop attacking me, please. I mean no harm. 
Kitty, help me find my purse, please. Maybe I can do something about this. I'll see what I can do, Fran. Stop attacking my friend, Carrot. Okay. An old vegetable sitting on a boat. Uh, I really don't know what to do now. Uh... This is very weird. Okay, there's this. Oh, there's her purse. Okay. Oh. Okay. We got rocks. Maybe I can... Yeah, and I'll put the rock. Yeah. Friend, my darling, I got the purse. That's amazing. You're the best, Mr. Midnight. Now show this, show the sir who is attacking me my family picture. Maybe he understands what a human is. Well, I hope he really does. Uh, where are you taking me, sir vegetable? That just made it worse. They want to help you, Fran. I can feel it. Don't be afraid, my friend. Kitty, stop them. Please, don't leave me. I'll be right here with you. Okay. So we're a tree now. Vegetative state. All right. So we got through chapter two. We got through chapter two, and that was a very interesting experience. Um, yeah. So, we completed a ritual today. Um, we killed a really ugly bug. We met some pinecone people. We met a jazz musician who's an ant. We combed a rat. We combed a tree that turned out to be little butterflies. We performed a satanic ritual to r unleash the souls from two sisters who hate each other. And now we're a tree. This is a really interesting game. Really interesting. Well, it's getting pretty late. I have to work at 7 a.m. tomorrow. I'm pulling a double, so I am going to get going. Uh, maybe we'll play Chapter 3 next week. This was a very interesting experience. I'm really liking this game. It's very weird, though. I honestly have no clue what's happening half the time. So... Um... Thanks, everyone, for watching me tonight. Yeah, maybe it'd be better if they didn't care at all. So, um, I'm gonna get going. Thanks for watching my stream. I'll be streaming again on Friday. Um, what am I playing on Friday? Forgot what I'm playing on Friday. Fall Guys! Fall Guys Friday! I'm working until close on Sunday, so I won't be able to do my Sunday Fall Guys. But maybe Friday Fall Guys will become a thing. I don't know. We'll find out. So, come back on Friday, 8 p.m. Fall Guys. So, thanks for coming, guy coming, guys. You're all super cool. So, that's okay. Alright, well, good night. Stay hydrated.